Hello Sapid Survivors, Kato Genesis here, this time bringing you a guide for the Nuka World expansion for Fallout 4, going over where to find all 15 of the official Nuka World recipe books. Throughout the park and even in your settlements when you make it so, you will have access to Nuka Mixer stations, which let you blend Nuka Cola and other questionable ingredients for even more soda flavors. You start with 5 of these recipes by default, leaving you to explore the park to find the other 15, for a grand total of 20 extra Nuka Cola flavors. There is plenty of ground to cover, so let's get started. After your brutal introduction into Nuka World, you will find yourself in Nuka Town, USA. Here, inside of Cappy's Cafe, on the countertop in the kitchen is where you will find the recipe for Nuka Side. For the introduction of this list, this is a crime in soda form, requiring all original flavors of Nuka Cola to create. Next is called Nuka Love. South southwest of the train station is a place called Evan's home. Here you meet Evan, a surprisingly friendly wastelander, and after introductions he will just give you the recipe free of charge. What an appropriate recipe from such a nice guy. Towards the marshland northwest of Evan's home, you will find Nuka Fruity in the Hobologist's outpost. It is on the booth's table inside the diner building. Be aware, the Hobologists are a different kind of friendly. The fourth recipe is for Nuka Punch, which is found in the Grandchester Mystery Mansion. This attraction is off the beaten path from the rest of the park towards the southwest corner of the map. Survive up to the top floor room just before heading into the attic. It should be sitting on the table. Heading towards the rest of the park, Nuka Cooler can be found in the Galactic Zone. Go into the Galactic Zone market to the left of Star Control, and this one should be on one of the bookshelves in the vendor stands. However, if anything exploded nearby, you might also find it close somewhere on the ground. The Starlight Interstellar Theater is to the left of the main entrance of the Galactic Zone. Inside of this theater you will locate Nuka Void. Towards the back of the seating area is what looks like a snack bar, possibly manned by a sentry bot, the recipe for Nuka Void usually residing on the counter. In the northeastern portion of the Galactic Zone is the Robco Battle Arena. This is where you'll find the recipe for Nuka Ray. It is normally sitting on the shelves in the gift shop to the left of the entrance. The Nuka Power recipe is found where you would expect the Nuka World Power Plant. It is on the western edge of the Nuka World map, a straight shot from the park itself. And after making it inside, confusing as its layout may be, what you are looking for is a small office containing two pre-war skeletons who are having a very important meeting. The Nuka Power recipe will be on the desk. Returning to the park, we now turn towards Dry Rock Gulch, the attraction that is north of the Galactic Zone, in search of our Nuka Sunrise. Entering from the south side, the first thing you'll likely discover is the Dry Rock Gulch Theater. Part of the theater is a locked storage room under the stands. There should be a key for it somewhere in the gulch, otherwise, get those bobby pins out. The recipe for Nuka Extreme is almost directly above where the previous one was. If you are still in the Dry Rock Gulch Theater, move up the stands and there's a set of wooden stairs that go up to the roof. The recipe book sits on the metal table and this is also where you set a flag of the gang of your choosing, once you get to that point of the main quest. The 11th recipe book and third to be found in Dry Rock Gulch is called Nuka Bomb Drop. There are a couple mobile concession stands to the left side of Mad Mulligan's coaster ride, or to the right of the Bandit Roundup. Sitting directly on top of the concession stand is the recipe book. Moving towards the Safari Adventure, northernmost in the main attraction area, is where we find Nuka Rush. Entering Safari Adventure, it makes sense that the first thing you would see is the Welcome Center. This recipe book is sitting on the Welcome Center counter. Nuka Hardy is also found in Safari Adventure, and is actually tucked behind the Jungle Journey Theater inside what looks to be a tool shed. This is also south of the Reptile House. To the eastern side of the main park area is Kitty Kingdom, where we shall locate the revitalizing Nuka Elixir recipe. Here there are two main attractions, one of which is the Fun House. Fun as it may be, what you're actually looking for is the control room in here. Find it and this recipe book is sitting right next to the terminal. The 15th and last recipe called Nuka Berry is found in King Cola's castle of the Kitty Kingdom. Go into the theater and find the backstage area, and it is in the actors' and actresses' rooms on the right side. 
And that is all 15 of the official Nuka World Nuka Cola recipe books. Adding this together with the default recipes at the Nuka Mixer station, you have a grand total of 20 carbonated concoctions that you can make. So what's your favorite flavor to enjoy during a hot or radiated or combat filled day or a mixture of the three? Put it in the comments, I'd love to hear about it. If you found this guide useful, entertaining, or both, do whatever it is you see fit to show that. And if you want more like this, you know what to do. Thank you so very much for watching. This is Kato Genesis, and may you wander Nuka World and the Commonwealth like you own it.